Hare Krishna. I have a very interesting news to share with all of you about a very divine abode on earth. At least it's called Bhu Vaikuntha. Bhu means earth, Vaikuntha means spiritual world. The spiritual world on earth. Do you know which is the place? It is Pandarpur Dham. What is so special about Pandarpur? You know, Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, during his South India travels, and he visited Pandarpur Dham to meet his brother Vishwarupa, who had taken sannyas, and he was staying in Pandarpur. There, we read about it in the Madhya Leela, 9th chapter of the Chait- Chaitanya Charitamrita. So, in this very, very divine abode where the Chandra Bhaga river is flowing, lakhs and lakhs of um, traveling yatriks come four times a year to take darshan of Lord Vithala and Rakumai, who are none other than Rukmani Dwarakadesh, and take their darshan, take a dip in the holy river, do kirtans, bhajans in glorification of the Lord, and hear the katha. It's a very beautiful place. In that holy place, a very beautiful spiritual edifice is going to manifest. Here is the most interesting information I am going to give you. His Holiness Lokanath Swami Maharaj, who was born in a place very close to Pandarpur Dham called Aravade. As a school going boy, he was always charmed by Vittal Rakumai. And the beautiful kirtans that Varkaris do, coming in lakhs, he was touched by the spiritual culture. Later, when he came to Bombay during his college days, he saw the Western Vaishnavas of Viscon society and was deeply touched. He thought these people from America and other countries are coming and teaching us Bhagavad Gita. What are we doing? So he went to the Cross Maidan festival for the first time and he met Srila Prabhupada and he fell in love with Prabhupada's teachings and he became an initiated disciple and uh, joined. Uh, is called Temple in Juhu. Eventually, seeing him as a great singer and preacher of Bhagavad Gita, Prabhupada told them, take the holy name around all over the world. Uh, following order of Prabhupada, Maharaj has taken the holy name across hundreds of countries worldwide, Padayatva worldwide. And he had a heart that I want to see a beautiful temple manifest in. Uh, Pandarpur, because the place is very dear to the Gaudiya Vaishnavas, very dear to Lord Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, and very dear to the heart of the Varkari Vaishnavas. And all over the world, devotees are coming to see Pandarpur. And there will be a very beautiful temple. So I'll tell you some special features of this temple. There is going to be a very beautiful dome which will look like Lord Vithala's shape uh, above. And from all sides one can see that. And also the temple hall is very aesthetically going to be designed with beautiful white marble. And also the, there are going to be deities of Shri Radha Pandarina. And the spiritual positive vibrations of the temple, um, you know, will uh, be absorbing for all the people who visit the temple, chant the holy name, share the holy kata. And already it's a dham. Just like Sri Ramayapur or Sri Vandavan Dham. Similarly, this is an abode of the Lord where this temple is going to be manifest. And also, there is going to be a multi-purpose hall below the temple where there will be Vaikuntha Bazaar, uh, temple in the upper floor. In the upper floor, we have Vital Mandir, Radha Krishna Mandir, Lakshmi, Ram, Lakshman, Sita Hanuman, and Gaurnetai. And also the temple will have very beautiful museum and Bhaktivedanta Medical Center, International Guest House, and Varkari Bhavan, Prasadam Hall. So there are various features of the temple. And it's going to be in the very beautiful, attractive campus, very close to Chandra River. So uh, we invite every one of you to support in this most noblest of the endeavors where hundreds and thousands and millions of Devotees are going to congregate and chant the holy name of the Lord and hear the Srimad Bhagavatam. Please take advantage of this opportunity to be a part of this project, which is not just a Pandarpur project, 
not just a Maharashtrian project, it's a national project because uh, even many people from South India worship Vittal Rakumai, Vittal Rakuni. They come for Vittal Rakuni Darshan doing Kirtan also. They can keep their hands like this and they dance also. Yeah. Even as a, a small boy, I have heard many bhajans of Rakuni Vittal. So, no, it will be a great uh, service opportunity for every one of you to be a part of this most glorious project that Pandarpur Dham is gone Pandarpur. Hare Krishna.